Hi everyone, welcome back to another episode of Coffee Talk. Here I am uh, in the garage once again, starting off a new uh, recording session, uh, playing Coffee Talk. Oh yeah, the last time I played Coffee Talk, oh man, I had such a good time you guys, I really enjoyed myself. So hopefully we could recreate that magic somewhat on today's episode. Uh, got a few announcements, you know, it's, yeah, it's a new recording session, gotta have new announcements. Uh, we got some, we got, oh man, you guys, after I played Death Stranding, I was like, I don't know what to play anymore. And so I gathered up all the video games I could get my hands on. I made like 20 episodes of Chilling with Cold Creature. But now I have way too many games that I want to play. First off, there's Coffee Talk. I really enjoy this game. I want to keep playing it. I don't think it's very long, so eventually I'm going to finish it. Uh, it's coming around uh, almost to July, which means it's time for the annual uh, season four uh, uh, show, uh, <laughs> my series of um, Journey to Day 400 and uh, Don't Starve. Should be doing the last four, uh, the last 100 days. That should be pretty good. A little, little mini uh, series, about 30 episodes maybe. Um, also, The Last of Us 2 just came out. It's a pretty cool game, um, maybe. A lot of people say it's not good. A lot of people say that it is good. I think it's probably good. Uh, maybe. We'll have to see. My brother bought it. Uh, I was thinking about, oh man, how am I going to, let's see. I was starting to make my budget. I was like, alright, let me see. Uh, cut down on food, maybe. Maybe uh, don't buy so much uh, expensive stuff on Amazon or eBay. Cut down on this. And then my brother's like, hey, I got The Last of Us too. I'm like, what the heck? It was delayed one day, but then on the second day that it came out, finally got it. He's been playing it. I made another bed with him. Because <laughs> he's like, oh yeah, it's going to be such a good game. I'm going to pass it. I'm like, there's no way you're going to pass The Last of Us 2. Pretty sure you passed The Last of Us, the first one. Uh, but other than that, the only game he's ever played is Animal Crossing and uh, Destiny. Those are the only games. Or oh, Destiny 2. Those are the only three games that he ever plays at all. Uh, he played a bunch of games on the Nintendo Switch. Uh, they didn't go too well for him. He didn't re uh, pass many of those games. He just played for them, played on them for a little bit, and then uh, he gave up. A lot of Mario games, a lot of uh, Zelda games. Uh, what else? He didn't pass Skyrim. He didn't pass uh, Alien Isolation. I don't know if you remember back in the day when I was doing my uh, Alien Isolation playthrough. I had a bet going on, uh, maybe not a bet, just, you know, it was just because I told my brother that he I, I, he couldn't pass it because I was playing it. I was like, there's no way you're going to be able to play this game. He's like, yeah, I will. And he started playing with it, playing, uh, playing it, and um, he got stuck, he got too scared, he started complaining, and then he didn't play it. But anyway, he, um, that game, the Star Wars game, uh, Jedi Order... Uh, the, the 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 new Star Wars game, the one where you're that guy with a blue lightsaber. Remember that guy? Um, yeah, he bought that game. He didn't even open the package. He just left it there, and he never played it. Another game. Let's see. He's got plenty of games. Stardew Valley. He also had that game. Never played it. Never opened the package. Hello Neighbor. Never opened the package. Uh, Little Nightmares. You know that little game when you're that little girl running around. There's monsters everywhere bought like a special edition of that never opened that it's probably like a collector's thing that's why they didn't open that one but there's a ton of games that he's played Every, literally 95% of the games that he buys he never plays so I gave I made another bet with him $20 bet <laughs> that it wouldn't pass The Last of Us 2 because it's too stressful for him I know him he doesn't like stressful games but then I forgot that he's not working right now he's on um vacation because of the COVID-19 thing he's not going he's not working right now he's fine he, he's also filed for unemployment so we got that going on uh so oh my god I'm probably gonna lose he hasn't he's literally not stopped played it not he's he's been playing it non-stop for almost three days now I think today is the third day I don't know anyway here we are uh, playing coffee talk. Oh, yeah. No, no, no. Wait, what was I talking about? Um, back to what I was talking about. All those games, uh, chilling with cold creature that I played. All those videos I did. Uh, coffee talk. You know, I'm playing this a lot. Um, don't starve. I need to play that again. 
And uh, the last was two. We gotta play that. And Spun SpongeBob Battle for Bikini Bottom Rehydrated. Yeah, that's an incredible game. Oh my god, you guys, that's one of the oh one of the few games that I really love to play on the PlayStation 2. My brother bought it for me. He was such a nice guy back then. PlayStation 2. Oh my god! Back when we had the memory cards. Remember, you guys, we had to get memory cards for the the PlayStation 2 to record our um, our save data. Oh, I actually have a very tragic story about the save data. Maybe remind me, guys, to tell you about that story. When I played um that SpongeBob game, I really want to play that game. That's definitely. Not, we're not even gonna have any formalities with the episode of Chilling with Gold Beach. I'm just gonna play it. Same with uh, The Last of Us 2. I'm just gonna play the game. Oh, hopefully it's gonna be good. <laughs> oh my god. Anyway, let's get on with today's episode. And Coffee Talk, here I am. Six minutes. Ooh, look at that. I'm not even halfway done with my progress. Let's start the game. Load. Oh, man. Oh man, I got bad news you guys. I don't have water and I don't have coffee. I don't have tea. I don't have anything right now. After today's episode, I'm probably going to have to go out into the house. Guess I'm going to drink because oh my god. I, my mouth is super dry. Super, I'm super thirsty. I don't know what I was thinking. I was just... Ugh, I was really lazy today, you guys. I don't want to record any. I, I've been... <laughs> I, I just have so much stuff I want to talk about it. I can't talk about it too much because the whole game is just a bunch of uh, reading dialogue. Let me tell you about this thing that I've been doing. Um, I've been listening to the audiobook for The Martian. Every night I just listen to it all night. And because of that... Mm. Uh, I don't know if you can tell, I haven't had a lot of... I haven't been getting a lot of sleep. Usually I don't get a lot of sleep, but now I'm getting even less sleep because I've been listening to The Martian every night for like three hours and then eventually I fall asleep and the next day I have to like find, <laughs> remember, find the last place I remember listening to the audiobook. I'm down to like the last two hours of the audiobook, so I'll probably finish it tonight, hopefully, because my goodness gracious. Um, yeah, so I woke up really, really late today. I didn't want to do anything. Went to the grocery shopping. Got some burgers from uh, uh, Burger King. Burgers from Burger King make me very thirsty, guys. I don't know what's going on with that. They put too much salt in the burgers from Burger King. And um, I'm really thirsty. But I'm also really full. I had a coupon for like one, buy one Whopper, you get another one for free. Uh, <laughs> and I ate both of them. Oh my god, I don't know what I was thinking. Well, I ate an impossible. Whopper and it was pretty good but then I was like man I want a real Whopper and I was still like not I hadn't eaten anything at all for like uh, I don't know like 15 hours so I go I, I finished the first one and I ate the other one oh god oh wake up you stupid idiot oh god I gotta record I gotta be more professional you guys my YouTube channel has been taking another hit you guys i've lost uh, two subscribers and i haven't been getting any views but uh that review of that monitor is still getting a lot of views and likes so i actually got two dislikes now which is pretty bad but pretty fair also so let's uh let's, uh, let's just get on with, with this video look at this nine minutes into the video and i'm, I'm i still haven't done any gameplay all right that's it for the announcements <laughs> let's just play the game freya says where were we? Oh, man. Perfect way to start today's episode, you guys. I don't even remember where we were in the last episode. Uh, the main character. The character feels... The character feels very you. You bet. If the readers know me, they'll notice right away. Is that okay? Sure. Why not? Sounds so narcissistic. Don't worry about it. Uh, they won't notice... <laughs> they won't notice it unless they know me personally. And having the main character uh, think like me makes it easier to write, if you say so. Err, uh, sorry. Hmm. Oh man, look at this girl. I completely forgot about this girl. What is she? She's got like tentacles. Did you say something? Yes. Sorry for interrupting. Are you a fiction writer? Yes, I am. That sounds so cool. 
Well, yeah, but only but I only write uh, small scale fiction, short stories for the newspaper. Oh god, sorry guys, I'm not falling asleep because of the game and the, and the reading. I'm falling asleep because I haven't slept anything in the last like three or four days. Short stories from the newspaper, or non-fiction stories about people in this town. She's writing a novel right now, you know. In fact. I was just reading the draft for it. Oh man, look at Freya. She's like not very happy about this. And she's laughing at it. She's laughing. Hey! Wow! How many books have you written? Well, this will be my first book. If, uh, <laughs> if I ever finish writing. If I ever finish it. I always wanted to be a fiction writer. But conjuring words is hard. I'm a writer. And even I... And even I can use complex words like conjure, <laughs> like you just did. A lot of people have said that my vocabulary is uncommon. What do you do? What's your name again? What is your name again? Ah, pardon me, my name is Aqua. Aqua? Aqua. Aqua. Okay. Hi, Aqua. I'm Freya. And the barista here is Saul Goodman. Greetings, Miss Aqua. Nice to meet you. So yeah, uh, what do you do? Um, I'm a researcher at the university. I also make games in my free time. Oh man, she makes games. Well, wow, that's fantastic. Hey, that's an even cooler. That's even cooler than my job, you know. Thanks. You said you can't write, but uh, re wait, what? Did he just say that? What did I just read? Hang on, you guys. Technical difficulties. I think I just read something wrong. You said you can't write, but research papers... You had a lot of writing skills, right? Ah. Indeed. But it's... But it's descriptive writing, not narrative writing. What kind of fields are you researching, by the way? I focus on computer graphics. Oh, It involves a lot of calculations and boring stuff. Not something the media would... Uh, cover, I guess. It wouldn't attract many readers. Oh my! I forgot. You're a journalist! I'm sorry. I didn't mean to offend you. Ha 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 ha! Oh look, you're not getting her laughing animation. Ha ha! Come on! You don't have to worry so much about everything. It's alright. Excuse me for interrupting. Yes? You said you're a researcher in computer graphics, right? That's right. Did you write a paper on the latest fluid re rendering technique for 3D environments? I believe one of the contributors is also named Aqua. Oh my, yes, that's me. Did you read it? I did. Yeah, it was pretty important for the project we're working on. Oh man, she's go she goes to the same university, I think. Um, may I ask what kind of project it is, that is? It's a video game series called Full Metal Conflict. Oh man. Are you kidding me? You work for F um, FMC? Oops. I'm sorry, I got a bit excited. I got a bit too excited all of a sudden. Don't be. It's nice to meet you and someone who likes. It's nice to meet. It's nice when you meet someone who likes the thing you're working on. You work on. <laughs> I love that CV so much. My name is Aqua, by the way. But you already knew that. <laughs> My name is Myrtle. Myrtle. Urgh. What do you? Uh, what do you do in the project? I'm one of the technical artists. Oh, I mean, <laughs> oh. Ah, no wonder. Yeah, I don't want to intrude in your discussion any further. That's right, Myrtle. Go back to your drinking your milk. <laughs> Sorry, that's mean. Uh, but could I ask uh, for your business card or something? Me and some friends. Ha me and some friends have something we want to discuss. We submitted uh, queries through your department's contract form. We haven't received any replies. Oh yes, that happens a lot. The form sends queries to another department, and sometimes it takes them a bit of a bit of, uh, takes them a bit of, a bit to respond. <laughs> a bit of time, a bit to respond. Pardon us for that. Of course, uh, should have expected that. Should have expected that. Um, 
I don't have my card with me right now. But, um, we could swap email addresses if you want. Sure. Here's my email. Yup, got it. Full Metal Complex Series. This Full Metal. This Full Metal Complex Series you two are, are talking about. Is it the same series as getting a movie adaptation soon? Oh my god, this guy. Oh. Uh, I'm sorry to say, you guys, but this uh, conversation is very interesting. I really like that space guy. Ho hopefully he comes back. Or maybe Officer Georgie? Yeah, Officer Georgie. Uh, yeah, that one. To be honest, I hated the idea of turning the game into a movie. None nonetheless, Hollywood. They have the budget for the flashy visuals, but I doubt they'll do the series justice. Why? Because some games tell their stories in a unique way, and some stories can only be told through this medium. And F FMC is no exception to that. Interesting. Do you play video games? Well, not much. I usually play weird, obscure art games. The type of games you might see in an art gallery. Really? That is weird. You're not the first to say I'm weird. Uh, it's not that. Usually people that play RD games are gamers that <laughs> got bored of the current stat state of video games. That's true, but I believe art games cater to a whole different market compared to the mainstream games. Hence a lot of the players are not gamers. They're more accessible to play, uh, but harder to uh, perceive. Understanding them requires a whole different level of many things. Uh, hey, sorry, I rambled on for too long. <laughs> but at least that's what I think. Good point. Yeah, that was a really good. That was a really good perspective. Uh, I play those types of games thanks to people I hang out with. Oh look, she's laughing. Ah, oh, Myrtle, I've never seen her laugh. <laughs> Yeah, you got that look of an artsy hipster, you know. She does look like a hipster. That's what I was trying to say. Nailed it. So you understand my point about the adaptation, right? Kinda. Anyway, I need to go back. I'll email you first thing tomorrow about our question. Wait, what time is it? Oh my, I also need to go home. Oh no, all my customers are leaving. Hey, get back here. <laughs> Wait, my hand around. Uh, oh, what the fudge? Oh, thing just flew right past in front of my face. Oh my god, you guys, my mouth is so dry. I need to get water, you guys. Um, we can talk to the, we can walk to the, we can talk, we can walk to the bus stop together if you want. I hope that doesn't bother you, Miss Myrtle. Just Myrtle is fine. <laughs> of course, it won't bother me at all. Uh, shall we go now? Sure. Thank you so much, Saw Goodman. Hey, no, no, no problem, no problem. <laughs> you too, Miss Miss Freya. Uh, good luck with writing. You take care on your way, okay? <sighs> Will do. See you around, folks. That's all, folks. Uh, uh, please be careful on your way back. Oh man, everybody leaves. Looks like it's just you and me again, Freya. Is the day almost over? Hi, Freya. So, yes, that was a nice talk. But you haven't given, um, you haven't give me a, you haven't give, but you haven't give me proper, you haven't given, shouldn't it be you haven't given me proper feedback? You haven't give me proper, aha! I found a typo on this video game, you guys. Oh, man. But you haven't given me proper feedback for the draft yet. And I could see that you were reading it on. Enough. <sighs> man, time flies. Well, it's kind of good. Eh? Seriously? That's it? Uh, I'm not an editor. Yeah, Freya. Did you expect me to have a list of notes for you? Yes. Really? You're mysterious. Ah, my freaking ear got very itchy right there. You guys worry about that. You're mysterious. That much is true. But I've uh, been a regular here for a while. 
I recognize the expressions you were making as you read it. You have a lot of comments, right? Hmm. Admit it. Hmm. Okay, yeah, got me. But it won't be short. And I would really... And I will be really honest with you. Oh, man. Goop. Well, the night is young. Bring it on. Okay, ready for this, Freya? Let's start at the beginning. Oh, no. I wanted to read all the... The Grinch. The Grinch. What the fudge? Is that a real drink? Are these real drinks that I'm seeing here? Green, spicy, and not everyone's cup of tea. Ooh, it's kind of gross. All right, you guys, hang on. I need to take a break. Oh my god, I don't know why I started today's episode without any coffee or without any. It's pretty late as well. It's, it's ten, you guys. I gotta get a drink. Hang on, you guys. I'll be right back. Sit tight. I'll be right back tomorrow with another video for me i'll be playing it in like five seven minutes but for you guys you'll have to see the next video tomorrow sorry that more than uh, like half almost half of this video was just me talking about me and my personal life but that's another reason why i have this youtube channel so that i could vent all of my personal feelings and um um uh stress i guess i don't know um, yeah, this is where I talk a lot about my stuff. Yeah, yeah. <clears throat> anyway, thanks everybody for watching. Please leave a like and subscribe, and I'll see you soon.